Hi there, I'm just going to give you a quick demonstration of how a modified mini disc player works. In front of me I have a Sony MDS-JE510. -E, MDS um, it's a regular sort of mini disc player. Um, I'm going to show how it's modified to work with a foot switch control. This particular machine at the moment is a machine that's fitted with auto pause. Um, I've currently set it up to simulate a situation that you might encounter if you're a singer or a tribute act or entertainer. Um, for example, live on stage, this is how I use the mini disc players myself um, in a Blues Brothers tribute act. Um, so at the moment, we're looking as though we've got 11 seconds to run on our song, which is track four. Currently, the machine is in auto pause mode. Okay. So what would happen in a situation where your last 10 seconds of your track are playing is it would fade out like so. And if your machine is fitted with auto pause, then it will get to the end of the track like so. Two, one, and then it will pause ready for the next track. So there we go, we're on play pause mode for the song Roxanne, which is coming next. Um, the problem this presents for singers and entertainers is that at this point, they have to turn their back on their audience, come over to the machine, and to start this next track is manually press the play button, like so. Okay, these machines have actually been modified, so if I can just turn the mach this machine around and show you, On the back of this particular machine, you'll just see here in this corner, you'll find a quarter inch jack socket, which is a 6.3 mil standard plug um, that takes this kind of connector. Okay. Now the foot switches that I supply are brand new foot switches. They look rather like this, but instead of coming with this rather pathetic little flexi cable, which is about two meters long, I'll also modify the foot switches because to make it practical for any singer or entertainer you need something a little bit more robust and solid. The switch themselves are in a die cast metal box, they're nice and solid, okay? So what I'm going to do here is just to demonstrate how it works, I'm going to plug this jack plug into the socket in the corner, like so, turn the machine back around so you can now see the foot switch in operation. So, the situation would be, if I rewind this just to where we were previously, 11 seconds left to run on this particular track. This is the song fading out. This time, I've got my foot switch connected to the machine. Okay, so we've got three, two, one, and the auto pause cuts in, ready for track five. At this point, I don't have to face turn away from my audience. I can stay facing them. I press the foot switch, track five starts. If you don't have a machine with auto pause, this foot switch will also pause the machine, as so. Okay, it's a great machine. As I say, this cable here, a bit pathetic, a bit puny. So what I'll supply is something a little bit more heavy duty, such as this cable, uh, and it will be five meters long. So it's practical in the use for singers as well. I'm also happy to uh, accommodate anybody that has a problem with the foot switch control. Obviously the mini disc machines are not brand new. Um, they are used machines, but I do check them over and fully test them before I put them on eBay. I also clean the lens, um, and I'm happy to, to warranty any problems you have with the foot switch control, not with any other features of the machine itself. I can't guarantee that it won't it'll last forever. I'm not going to give a Sony guarantee. But should you have any problems with the foot switch, I'll gladly replace either the switch or the machine, or I'll conduct a repair which will make sure it is working before it's sent out to you. As I say, all these machines are fully tested. Now, again, just to show you once again, the switch will operate play and pause, like so. This particular machine is a 510. I have pretty much every Sony model of uh, machine that there are available. The MDS-JE480 is a machine that doesn't currently feature the auto pause, um, although it can be supplied with the auto pause on. I have a way of putting the auto pause on. However, when you receive this machine, you won't be able to turn it off if you require it to have auto pause. So it's a matter of choosing whether you'd like it to have the auto pause or not, because it will come supplied as such, and you won't have the means of changing it back the other way. Um, I'd recommend for singers that all those auto pause is left on. For playback purposes, I've never found a situation where I haven't needed it. Um, so that's basically the story of the modified mini disc player. Good luck, and uh, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. Thank you very much for watching.